Welcome to the Open Food Network. In this video, we'll show you how to add products to your enterprise. Once you've logged into your account at openfoodnetwork.org.uk, click on the Products tab. Then click the New Product button on the right. That brings you to the new product form. All fields marked with a red asterisk are required. Start by selecting your enterprise from the drop-down titled Supplier. Then enter your product name. You can optionally choose a unit size such as weight, volume or items. Then enter the value that relates to the unit size. You can also choose how this is displayed. Here you can see that this product will be displayed as 1kg, but you might prefer it to be large, small or medium for example. Next, use the Product Category drop-down to select the appropriate category. Now enter the price of the product in pounds. If you have limited stock, enter the quantity here, or if you prefer to not limit stock, tick the unlimited box and leave stock set to zero. Choose a tax category, which is the VAT rating. And optionally a shipping category if this applies. Click browse to choose an image file to be used as the product image. The product description box is where you can add some text to accompany your product. Finally, you can choose to either create or create and add another to be brought back to the add new product form. On the product screen, you can now see the new product. To add variations, click on the expand arrow to the left of the product listing. If your product has variations, such as small, medium and large, for example, you can add these here to save you having to create separate products for each variation. Here we'll enter the name, unit, price and stock setting for our new variation. Click Save Changes to add the variation. On the product page, it is possible to add or remove columns from the view using the Columns button so you can see the information you want. That's all for this video. We hope you found it helpful. Remember, you can access a full user guide and support forum via our website openfoodnetwork.org.uk. Just click on the support tab.